रायपुर क्लास एट साइंस एंड टेक्नोलॉजी चैप्टर फर्स्ट स्काई विजन लेट्स सी क्वेश्चन आंसर एक्टिविटीज क्वेश्चन नंबर वन सम स्टार्स विच आर बिगर देन द सन अपियर स्मॉलर टू अस वाई सम स्टार्स विच आर बिगर देन द सन अपियर स्मॉलर टू अस बिकॉज वेन द थिंग्स आर फोर अवे फ्रॉम अस दे अपियर स्मॉलर टू अस Second, one star is 3.4 light year away from the Earth. What does this means? One star is 3.4 year away from the Earth. That means the light rising from the star will take around 3.4 years to reach at the Earth. Question number third: How would you find the star which appears to be in the north? We know that our our Earth is rotating around its axis from as to west west to east but we find the stars moving from east to west one star which is in the north appears motionless we know it by the name of pole star means dhruv tara recognize the planet according to the information given the biggest planet is jupiter the planet which has life earth the brightest planet is venus The red planet is Mars. The first planet discovered with the telescope is Uranus. The planet with three rings, Saturn. The planet with eight satellites is Neptune. Give short notes on those heavenly heavenly body that would not take the shape of the planet. Satellite asteroids are heavenly body that could not take the shape of a planet. Satellite are move around. some other heavenly body moon is natural satellite body moon is the natural satellite of the earth asteroids are revolve round the sun in an orbit between mars and jupiter asteroid is said to be that parts of matter those heavenly body which have a long shining tail comet and uh, comets are heavenly body which have a long shining tail it is revolves round the sun we can see them only when they are very near to the sun its characteristic features is small bright head with long tail the tail of com uh, comet also points away from the sun usually the comet is seen after a fixed interval of time Halley comet is one such comet which appears after 76 years last time it was seen in 1986 give the difference between meteors and meteorites answer meteors sometimes during dark night we may see bright lines of light in the sky they are meteors meteors are in the sky meteor meteorites some met meteors do not burn up completely in the atmosphere they are meteorites meteorites are on the earth fill in the blank group of star coming a particular shape is called constellation the heavenly body which revolves around any planet is called satellite the blank star seems to be fixed at the north direction pole the shape of the blank blank in the blank we have to fill kalpurush constellation is like a hunter choose the correct alternative the planet closest to the sun is mercury asteroids are found in between those these planets mars and jupiter this planet does not have any natural satellite is mercury this is not a member of the solar system is constellation this is not a constellation halle question and answer why do we find the sun 
to be the biggest and the bright uh, brightest star the sun is closest to the earth that is because the sun is the biggest and brightest star why does the pole star appear to be stationary stationary we know that our star is rotating around its axis from west to east the pole star is situated close to the rotation of the earth that is because a pole star appears to be stationary draw diagram of the position of different stars in ursa major and orion means you can draw very easily uh, to see your um, textbook next four venus is not the nearest planet to the sun when uh, then why is it the brightest venus is the second planet from the sun in distance it is the brightest of all the heavenly bodies seen by us its brightness is due to the thick cloud in its atmosphere which reflect back uh, about three-fourths of the sunlight received by it how will you recognize to the fall star pole star are bigger than other star it is situated in the north of earth and it motionless write the name of the planets as for their increasing distance from the sun the name of the planet as per their increasing distance from the sun they are mercury venus earth mars jupiter saturn uranus and neptune six number and now we come into seven here in last uh, uh, spell out difference between a planet and a star planet have low temperature but stars have high temperature planet do not have oven light but stars have oven light planet consists solid liquid and gases but star have consist of matters like hydrogen helium etc thank you and subscribe my channel